Thursday morning, day two of the Key West Poker Run, and a much better start today than we had yesterday. Yesterday, uh, we started out rainy and overcast and very, very windy. Today, we're starting with zero wind, blue skies. It's sunny and hot already, only 10 to 9 in the morning, and it's probably close to 80 degrees already. You can see there's a lot of activity behind me as we have participants from all over the United States, and in this case, Europe. Yes, we've got Team Germany here with the advantage and they've got these two brand new Levy craft boats which are built here in the US going on the run. And just to prove to you that a smaller twin engine or even these two single engine boats are really ideal boats for the poker run. You don't have to have a big million dollar machine to be on the Key West poker run. Our plan today is a little bit different than yesterday. We are going to take the same course. We are going to stop at Gilbertson Key Largo all together today about 120 to 125. That's much bigger than we expected because the weather's good and everybody wants to go to the Florida Keys. Here's Josh Kirkland and his crew from Georgia and this 42-foot fountain. He's got two apes on board. His first run with the club all the way from New Jersey, Brian Aloy in this 38-foot hustler slingshot. What a cool looking ride. Say hi to Jeff and Marilyn Whitlock all the way from Alabama with this 42-foot MTI cat team. Do it. After a 50-mile ride through Biscayne Bay, we now arrive at Jewfish Creek in Key Largo, rafting up at Gilbert's Resort for our lunch stop and another poker cart. It's a big party here at Gilbert's today. We've got boats rafted up almost 10 deep as over 250 to 300 people enjoy lunch here at Gilbert's. And they do a great job on the food every time. The ladies are looking fine and sipping their fruity drinks, but it's time to get back in the water because we've got 110 miles to go. Say hi to Bob and Elberg on their 50-foot Nortec Team Artemis. They've got a sexy crew on board today. And they are off as we head through the winding waterways of the upper Florida Keys. Everybody is just laying back, keeping chill on the throttles as they go through this critical navigation area through the mangroves and upper bay waters. And how can you not love this scenic ride through the Florida Keys? That's what everybody comes here for. And that's why Warren Foreman from Texas is here with this 46-foot skater called Team X-Rated, weaving through the Florida Keys. And here's Morchell and Benita Pryor from Virginia and their big 47-foot fountain lightning. Skip Raver, the owner of Cigarette, is here as our sponsor in this brand new Cigarette 1040, a 41-foot, 11-foot beam center console with stern drive power. Here's Hunter and Lauren Cole all the way from Michigan in this very cool 39-foot Ocean Express cat. I got a chance to ride this boat a few years back. Here's another big fast cat throwing a mean rooster tail. This is Chris and Nicole Ryder. This little 32-foot skater is one fast ride. And once again, a big addition to our Thursday run right here in the Middle Keys near Marathon is the Next Era Energy Power Marketing sponsored Yacht Mia doing the checkpoint here right off the back of the yacht. This is a big party we do every year. All the boats line up and they get a card as they touch and go and continue on their way further south towards Key West. Now, for those of you who are new to the show, remember that we are in the middle of a poker run event. So the cards they are picking up will be turned in in Key West, and all these players are competing against each other for big prizes, including a Ford Mustang convertible provided by OffLeaseOnly.com. We're back up to speed again on Bay Waters before we head offshore, and here's one of our fast cats. This is Jim Wiley in his 44-foot MTI Team 007. It's a turbine-powered beast. Again, the more popular center consoles coming on board. This is Jim and Lynn Archambault in their new 34 Sensation CCX. And here's another big cat, Gino Gargiulo. This is a 48-foot MTI Raging Bull Lamborghini. That's right, it's got the matching Lamborghini that's going to be down in Key West. And now we're closing in on Buddy Thomas from Massachusetts in his brand new 46-foot Outer Limits called All Set, powered by Big Chief Engines. Fast forward to Key West as we now arrive at our Poker Run headquarters at the Conk Republic Seafood Company where we have a four-day Poker Run Village stage that's open to the public, that's free to the public, and fantastic displays. We've got power boats, engines, exotic cars, all kinds of cool stuff on display, all free to the public to come by and find out what it's like to be a part of the Florida power boating lifestyle. And I can't even begin to tell you what the energy level here is in this Poker Run Village every day. Now, Thursday night, a lot of the boats were already in town. Remember that Friday is going to be a big race day here in Key West. So everything that involves high-performance marine is all here at the Poker Run Village. 
And we've got entertainment every night, Thursday through Saturday. Tonight it's all about the girls because we're doing some People's Choice Awards and you got to have pretty ladies to help out. There's the girls of FPC and, of course, the girls of Powerboat Nation. Yeah, we're talking about you. Don't go away. When we return, we'll have more highlights of the 22nd annual Key West Poker Run right here on Powerboating and Paradise TV.